Good evening, Black Pines fam. My name is Dee, and I work as a customer service rep at an online retail company. Now, you may be wondering, why are you listening to me? Well, I have something I want to talk about. You may or may not find it interesting, but the information is just too strange not to share and possibly have someone or people be intrigued as I am. I received a WhatsApp message a little while ago that I'm having a little difficulty believing. The news is from a source that is rarely wrong. But usually with something like this, I would have gotten several messages by now. But maybe many people haven't found out about it yet. Apparently, some young folks went to Lyme in Newberry Cemetery around 6.30 this evening and saw something very, very odd. The grave of a man buried three days ago had been dug up. The casket was still in the grave, but the top was missing. And so was the body. Listen, I sent out so many messages trying to get details about this story with no luck whatsoever. I don't really check for gossip and rumors, but let me tell you, this message has my brain working overtime. I need to know if this is true because, you know, hang on one second, I'm getting an alert on my phone. Okay, okay. Well, that alert was from Pelican Daily News. There is a corpse missing from Newberry Cemetery in Bethany. The man's name was Archibald John. His late wife could not be reached for comment and police are conducting an investigation. Now, tell me, where could this body be? Was this a grave robbery? But why would someone steal a corpse? I know people rob the dead. But steal the dead? And the more I think about this strange event, the more I wonder. Is it really a theft though? Was this man taken or did he leave his final resting place? Maybe this is a proverbial storm in a teacup or something much deeper is actually going on. <sighs> Send me a message on IG. Look for Black Pines broadcast. Tell me what you think. To whoever is listening, I hope the next time you hear from me, I have more to tell. Have a good night, folks. <laughs>